Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. A new database is simply a new organizational container that will hold all of the tables, forms, reports, queries, macros, and modules that you create for it. You can create a new blank database by simply clicking the New button at the left end of the database toolbar. You could also select File from the menu bar and choose New or New Database if you're using 97. And in Access 97 and 2000, after selecting that choice from the menu, that causes the New dialog box to appear. From here, you can select the blank database icon and click OK to bring up the File New Database window. If, however, you chose File and then chose New using XP or 2003, you will instead view the New File task pane at the right side of the Access screen. In the task pane, you may click Blank Database to bring up the File New Database dialog box. Here, in both versions, you give the new file a directory in which to reside by using the Save In drop-down, and then you type the name for the database into the file name box down at the bottom. Once you've done this, click Create and the new blank data container will appear. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.